Hello, my name is Alana and I live in my 2006 Honda Accord. In today's video, I'm going to be taking you along with me for a weekend in my life. Today is currently Friday. I have Friday, Saturday, Sunday off. So today is a social media work day. I just finished up doing all of my laundry. It was actually my first time in a laundromat after two years on the road. Uh, so that was fun. I made a TikTok about it if you want to go check that out. Uh, but now I need to head over to a cafe and get some computer work done because I can't do any computer work while I'm camping and working my seasonal job. <laughs> to the cafe! I also really need to go to the cafe because I need to charge my phone my headphones, and my solar-powered battery pack. Um, it's all dead after this week, so. Alrighty, I got all of my computer work done for today. I edited two different YouTube videos. Now I am heading out to White Sands National Park so that I can watch the sunset and enjoy the moonrise. So my seasonal field crew job is actually working at White Sands. So it feels kind of weird to be driving there in my own car on my own time just for fun. But the park only stays open late on nights of the full moon. So I think it's worth it. Plus we can't drive the work vehicle after dark, so we can never stay for sunset. So I'm gonna do this for myself and enjoy and take you guys along with me and then we'll go to, I think a Walmart for the night. Y'all need to figure your shit out. Okay, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> okay, so if you've ever visited White Sands National Park coming from Las Cruces, you know there's a border patrol check. And whenever I go through there in the work truck, it's fine. Uh, but whenever I go through in my car, because there's so much in my car it always triggers them and like the x-ray machines and so just now the guy was like asking me what was in my back seat because I had like it blocked on this side if I had any children he asked me to open my trunk that's a first uh he walked around scoped out my trunk uh then he slammed it shut was asking me about where I work where I live and I was like well it's complicated like I work at White Sands I'm part of CCNM he was like I don't know anything about CCNM who do you know at White Sands and I was like well Patrick and David he was like okay fine have a nice evening and I was like bro what bro you literally waved everybody through I, it's just because I have so much in my car it makes me sus Anyways, um, something to think about if you're considering living out of your vehicle. It does trigger even the Border Patrol agents of your own home country. Anyways, I'm very dehydrated from work, so I've been chugging these Pedialytes. This one low-key kind of tastes like medicine, but it's not bad. Anyways, uh, they're actually checking for national park passes tonight. They hardly ever check White Sands, which is kind of funny, but... I have my America the Beautiful pass and it's stamped September 2023. It's the second to last day of September, so they should take it. Um, but yeah, then I have to decide if I want another one or if I want to say adios national parks. But yeah, I'm almost into White Sands. I made it in good timing. There's a lot of people here, but that's to be expected. Uh, I think I'm going to go over to the backcountry trail because there's bathrooms there and then I can hike out a ways following the trail and find a place to set up. So, let's go! Alrighty, I have made it to the backcountry trail. The trail heads out that way. Um, I forgot a jacket for when it the sun sets and it gets cold, so I'm headed back to my car. But I think instead of following the trail that way where all the people are, I'm just going to keep walking that way because, as you can see, there's nobody over there. So, that's what I like. <laughs>
stopped and picked up a bowl of salad from Walmart before I drove out here. I think this is the Fiesta one. And then I also have some Fritos. And I'm just gonna chillax and enjoy my little hill. I can see the moon come up over there, the sun setting over here. It's a great setup. It reminds me of the first time I came here to White Sands, honestly, uh, which I think I vlogged and I will link here in the cards because that was a year and a half ago now. And that was also for a full moon night. It's crazy how much busier White Sands is on a full moon night compared to just your average day, <laughs> uh, like when I'm here working. And so now I'm sitting here with all the like public and I'm like, hmm. There's more to what you're seeing here, but y'all have no idea, <laughs> no idea what goes on at Y Sands. Do you guys know about the trackways? Mm. I think I need to sit like this so I can get the full, full picture. Gosh, there's so many cars here. It's crazy. Yeah, the jacket was a great call. Um, the sun has now gone down, and it's the last little bit of light, and I'm waiting for the moon. So I think I'm gonna do a little bit of yoga while I wait, because I have my yoga mat, and I need to stretch my body after last week of working. <laughs> So I have this bad habit of whenever it gets dark, I just forget about the vlog completely. So after I left White Sands last night, I went to a Walmart and parked up for the night. Uh, slept great. Now I'm at Planet Fitness. I'm going to eat a Cliff Bar, aka Breakfast of Champions, in the parking lot before I go in. Um, I'm going to try and work out before I shower and then head up the mountain. It looks like it's going to rain up in the mountains later this evening. So I don't know if I want to be there for that, but I definitely want to get up there f at least for the afternoon, even if I have to come back to the Walmart for tonight. So that's my update for this morning. I will check back in later when something more interesting is happening. <laughs> Um, I spent a while in Planet Fitness working out, stretching, and showering. Then I decided to go to the public library and do some work. And then instead of driving up to Cloudcroft, which was my original plan, but it was raining up there, I decided to turn around and come back towards Las Cruces and stay at a place that I love here. Um, but I came to a picnic area to make dinner. Unfortunately, there are other people. But what's on the menu tonight is a spinach Dijon salad. Um, I don't really like this dressing. I just got it because it's the only one that had spinach. I also have this uh, body armor. I also plan on filming some short format videos. So I think I'm going to go ahead and do that first. Then eat my salad. Then get out and boil my ramen. Then go find a spot to park up for the night. Because this is actually 
a fee area, so you can't um, stay here. So I just have to drive down the road a little bit. <laughs> All right, I'm a terrible vlogger. Sorry, guys. Uh, so the sunset was beautiful last night, but I was so busy filming my short form content and my Wednesday videos for YouTube that I completely spaced the vlog. So enjoy some photos of that beautiful sunset because I did not take a single video. <laughs> Anyways, now it is the next morning. It is Sunday morning, so it's my last day off. We did get a text update saying that the government is not shutting down, so I'm back to work tomorrow, um, which is good but also i was kind of looking forward to a day or two off but it's fine i'll still get my full paycheck so that's what we're going for um but that means that instead of just chillaxing all day today i do need to go to a cafe at least for the morning and get some stuff done and then we'll see about relaxing in the afternoon Alrighty, I forgot to record anything at the cafe, but I was at the cafe for a solid four hours editing. I got a table in my favorite spot, so that was nice. Then I went to Planet Fitness to shower, so I don't have to do that tomorrow morning before work. Then I stopped at Sprouts to grab some snacks for work tomorrow. I got some of those Justin's peanut butter packets, um, a protein cookie, and some protein shakes. Um, because that's something that we don't get with like our food budget for the job, but all of our meals and stuff and even some of our snacks are covered through the meal budget provided by CCNM. So that's really cool. Um, I save a lot of money that way. I'm not really buying much food except for what I'm eating on the weekends. So what I'm eating tonight is some sushi from Sprouts. This is the spicy California roll. It's pretty good. Um, and then I also have, where'd it go? I also had a plum clot. Plum what? Plum cot. Oh, there it is. I also have a plum cot. Um, I just needed a fruit besides apples and oranges because that's all we've been eating <laughs> out on Hitch. So I think I'm just going to finish eating these and watch a YouTube video. I'm watching Kara and Nate's Bora Bora video, which is fancy. Mm. Could you hear my jaw? Wow. Also, yes, I am eating sushi with my fingers. Sue me. Um, <laughs> anyways, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog here. I didn't do as much as I had wanted to do in this vlog. Uh, it turned into just a lot of computer work, as per usual. <laughs> But I hope this gave you a realistic idea of how I spend my weekends while I have a seasonal job. I really don't have much free time, and when I do, I have to plan ahead. So, like, I'll take one weekend off completely in the month, and then I'll be doing different things on the other weekends. So, that's my life for now, at least for the next three months. Uh, if you watched all the way to the end of this video, I appreciate you. Let me know down below, what are you doing right now? I'm eating sushi with my fingers and watching the sunset. I'm at the same spot that I was at yesterday. Hold on. Not the exact same, but right at the base of these mountains. Anyways, if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe down below so that you don't miss the next video. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.